What's happening, y'all? It is Thursday night, a little after 8 o'clock. Sitting on the porch and just chilling out for a little bit, as you can see. Uh, it actually feels quite nice out here right now in southwestern PA. Where earlier it was uh, topped out at about 80, it's like 83, 84 degrees. So that's that's quite warm for even this time of year. Um, I mean, yeah, we are in uh, getting ready to be in mid-April, but still, usually about mid-April, it's only about you know. Uh, Upper 50s, lower 60s, uh, upper 60s, lower 70s. It may be. So, it's, we got some very odd weather coming. Uh, you know, uh, yeah, we're supposed to get a thunderstorm. Actually, it, it feels like we're getting a thunderstorm tonight. So, uh, that'll be cool. I love storms. But, anyways, um, the other day, we went to a place called Redstone Cemetery. It's um, not too not too far away from my house. It's so uh, it's you know right at the top of the hill in Brownsville, basically. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. Um, still kind of sick, but uh, you know, like I said, it's still at the, it's at the top of the hill in Brownsville, pretty much. Uh, you know, it's it's a pretty decent sized cemetery, uh, but you definitely cannot tell how big it is from the road. Um, I've always wanted to go and, and check that place out. Well, I went once during the day uh, about two months ago. We just kind of drove up in the car and just drove up and around there, and it is it's big. It's really big. Well, the other night, we decided to go ghost hunting up there. And it was myself, my fiance, and uh, a couple of her friends that she met from where she works. Uh, uh, you know, it was uh, another, another uh, guy and a girl came. So, uh, I'm still... In the process of trying to, I, it's I made four videos. I'm trying to get them to, uh, instead of being four, you know, four videos. Uh, the, the there's two videos that are 13 minutes long. There's one video that's like five minutes long, and another one that's like two and a half. I'm trying to get instead of it being four you know shorter videos to be one for you know one long video but uh the other day whenever i went to go do it i got that shot cut and for some reason last night whenever i went to go uh i i was able to put them all together but whenever i went to go play it it froze everything up and it just wouldn't do anything so i got pretty pissed off and literally just you know shut everything off and and uh, shut my laptop off and just said to hell with it but uh, that's not the reason why I'm making this video the reason why I'm making this is because I made a comment this morning to my fiance asking her if she has had any weird nightmares since uh, since going she said no, but, um, I have, I've had multiple, um, multiple nightmares about, uh, a shadow creature, uh, walking out, like, we were, we were actually in the cemetery, and we walked in, they don't have like giant mausoleums there like they had I believe there's like one of them and it's like right in front 
um, you know, you, the, you know, the single mausoleum trip things, uh, well, I, I, in the dream, like, uh, I was walking by it, and a shadow creature, like, came out of there, and, like, was, like, basically trying to take me over, and, uh, that was one of them, another one was, we were walking around, and, um, uh, uh, something basically uh, possessed uh, one of the people I was with in the dream and then another one it possessed me it was really weird uh, but so, uh, we actually all had an experience up there uh, I, I know I caught it on the on it on the tape so I'll, you know whenever I get it uploaded I'll let you know but uh, they, uh, uh, we were all crouched down. I was recording facing the opposite direction, and, um, my fiance and her girlfriend, uh, heard kind of like a screeching noise, and then literally it sounded like something was running up behind us, and they said it sounded like it literally took flight and like flew in the tree or something like that well i yes I, I did hear it but i actually thought it was them walking up behind me and you'll see in the video that i me and the other guy literally get ran over by these two they're you know i mean me and the the other guy we were with he's six foot five and I mean, I'm not a big, you know, I'm not a tall, big guy, but I'm, I'm, you know, I'm 5'9", five, 5'8", five, you know, I weigh 200 some pounds, and my fiance is 5'1", and weighs 100, and, like, 110, 120 pounds, and the, the, the other girl is about 5'4", and probably weighs equally that much, and, they both so scared fucking ran us over it was so funny but ever since then ever since that point i've felt like i i felt like we wasn't alone um even when we left that night we left the cemetery now, mind you, I kept saying, you know, nobody's allowed to follow me. Nobody's allowed to follow us. I, you have to stay home. I had my, my all my blessed, you know, my, my protection stuff on. You know, I said a prayer before I left. I said a prayer, you know, up there. I said a prayer after I, after I you know, left there. When we left there and we got in a car, I didn't say anything, but I looked in the rearview mirror, and it looked like there was somebody sitting in the back seat in between the other two people. And there was multiple times that I actually, I ended up, I turned my head around just to look to make sure there was nobody else there. I didn't say anything because I didn't want them freaking out, or I didn't want anybody else thinking I was out of my mind. But that's what I kept saying. So, um, I I still gotta watch these videos, and I'll let you know if I, you know, I'll put it in a timeline if I see anything. Now, mind you, these videos <clears throat> I gotta get more light uh, for one. Um, well. Yeah, I gotta get more light for one, but I was using a, uh, a, uh, black light, you know, the purple beam light, you know, um, I was using that because I didn't want it to be too bright because obviously we're in a cemetery that they patrol all the time. And the cops were out that night. We actually passed the cop on our way to the cemetery. So, 
yeah, we didn't want to attract anybody. And on top of that, there's houses, like, right next to the cemetery on both sides. So, yeah, we didn't want to attract anybody. But they are a little bit darker videos. But, um, you know, for the most part, I tried to keep it to where, you you know, you can actually see at least a little bit in front of, uh, in front of me. Um, you know, I mean, I, in all reality, I should be a, I should be a freaking video photographer, because, <laughs> I mean, with it being dark, I actually think I did a pretty, pretty damn good job for, you know, what I've seen of it, so, and, and trying to hold a camcorder with, you know, a, a, a little flashlight with, uh, uh, an EM, EMF reader and a, uh, uh, um, uh, um, uh, an EMF, you know, uh, uh, digital recorder, so, uh, yeah, it was, it, it was a little bit hard, because obviously I don't have all the, you know, hands like that, so, but yeah, like I said, I gotta get, I wanna get a couple, you know, another light, uh, they actually have a pretty decent infrared light, uh, deta uh attachment for my camera, along with a microphone and a actual like handle for it you know that would be really cool and then um that way i it would actually it you know will come with another light now obviously i had it in night vision and i had the full spectrum on and all this stuff and it just uh, I didn't have the light on the camera on because the light on the camera, I, it, I, again, we are trying to be as uh, inconspicuous as possible. So, but yeah, it was, it's a little bit darker video, but I, I think you'll be able to see if there's something there. I know for a fact that I've seen a couple things. Uh, I seen something real freaky moving. Uh, uh, it, I was it was probably about fifty. Uh, I'd say about forty yards in front of me, and I know I caught it on camera because I was standing there watching it uh, through the lens, and I could only actually see it through the lens. I couldn't see it with my naked eye, you know. And I I even said that in in the video, so. Uh, it was, like, you, you can see lights, like, it's, it, you know, lights from, like, the, the grave, you know, because they have the, the decorations on it, and there's two of them about 40 yards in front of me, and you can actually see something moving in front of them, and it actually blocks out the, the lights and stuff, and, like, it, it, if you look hard enough, it actually looks like a silhouette. I'm going to try to, I'm going to try to try my best, if I can figure it out, to, um, to try to, you know, brighten everything up, like, to change the contrast and all that stuff. I'm going to try to do that on these videos. Again, I don't, I don't know how to edit videos, so I'm going to do my best, considering the, this is actually the, really the very first uh, or no, I'm sorry, the second, this is actually the second time we've actually gone out and did a, uh, an actual ghost hunt instead of being at home. <clears throat> so I want to try to get this, it'll be, you know, a little bit nicer. The further, you know, the more and more I do this, uh, or try to do this, I'm hoping that the more and more uh, better I'll get and all that stuff and again if, if anybody knows how to edit you know which I'm sure there's a lot of people out there that know how to edit videos uh, if you guys want to try to give me a hand I, I would be greatly appreciated you know that would be greatly appreciated so um, uh, so uh, yeah I will let you guys know uh, if anything else happens, and um, I'm going to try to have those videos up, 
either tonight and or tomorrow morning. Uh, if they're not up tonight, if I can't get them up tonight as one long video, I'll just say to hell with it and I'll put them on, uh, you know, put them up as four, four shorter videos. That's just how, that's just how I'm going to have to do it because I want to get them up. So, but I'm going to let you guys go. It looks like it's about to start storming and I'm going to just uh, chill and check it out. So I'll talk to you guys later.